Another thing that I have found out is that there are reports, and I don't know how widespread they are, that INEC officials, materials, and all of that got to where they should get to. There are reports like that. I don't know how widespread they are, and, and therefore it's again <coughs> um, perhaps early to make a conclusion. Conclusions must be based on facts, and you must assess the facts in a whole. Now, if that is the case, it is perhaps then possible, and I stress the word possible, that in those places where people, INEC was there on time, right, in those places, people may have accredited long before you and I came, and that perhaps what we were used to long queues that we did not see in those places, and I, and I stress that word in those places because we don't know how widespread it is, right? If we didn't meet long queues, we are perhaps then uh, disposed to jump into the conclusion that, oh, people didn't come out. When in fact, in those kind of places, they've come out, they've accredited themselves, and they got back. Last week, for example, when I voted here, the queue was as long as to the gate. And again, when we wanted to accredit, the queue was as long as to the gate. But don't forget that I came later today than I came last week. So many more people had accredited, I assume, before I got here. And if it was the case in this polling unit, I don't know that you will know that they were here on time. It's possible then that by the time I came, if you didn't see a crowd, that is not conclusive that people turned out or didn't turn out.